and shine, Mr. Freeman. Rise and shine. Not that I wish to imply you have been sleeping on the job. No one is more deserving of a rest, and all the effort in the world would have gone to waste until... Well, let's just say your hour has come again. The right man in the wrong place can make all the difference in the world. So wake up, Mr. Freeman. Wake up and smell the ashes. here in the citadel so thoughtfully provided by but this stop the it's all i have left i've been proud to be the only one on that train my home and so whether you are here to stay or are passing through stop that welcome to city 17. it's safer here Welcome to City 17. This must be a mistake. I got a standard relocation coupon just like everybody else. But It's me, Gordon Barney from Black Mesa. Hey, sorry for the scare. I had to put on a show for the cameras. I've been working undercover with Civil Protection. I can't take too long or they'll get suspicious. I'm way behind on my beating quota. Yes, Barney, what is it? I'm in the middle of a critical test. Sorry, Zar, but, but look who's here. Great Scott! Gordon Freeman! I expected more warning. Yeah, you and me both, Doc. He was about to board the express to Nova Prospect. Well, Barney, what do you intend? I'm thinking, I'm thinking. Alex is around here, somewhere. She would have a better idea how to get him here. Well, as long as he stays away from checkpoints, we should be okay. 
Listen, I gotta go, Doc. We're taking enough chances as it is. Very well. And, uh, Gordon? Good to see you. Okay, Gordon. You're gonna have to make your own way to Dr. Kleiner's lab. Oh, man! That's what I was afraid of. Get in here, Gordon, before you blow my cover. Pile up some stuff to get through that window and keep going till you're in the plaza. I'll meet up with you later. Line starts at the end. I also did you gotta be damn hungry to wait in line for this crap. I don't know about you, but I'm ready to join civil protection just to get a decent meal. You'll have to wait your turn like everybody else. You'll have to wait your turn like everybody else. I don't know about you, but I'm ready to join civil protection just to get a decent meal. Rather than try to answer every possible question you might have left unvoiced. First, let us consider the fact that for You're gonna the be first damn hungry to wait in line for this crap. As a species, immortality is in our image. This simple fact has far reaching implications. It requires radical rethinking and revision of our genetic imperatives. It also requires planning and forethought that run in direct opposition to our neural precepts. I find it helpful at times like these to if remind I talk to myself here, that we'll our true control. enemy is instinct. Instinct was our mother and the infant species. Instinct caught us and kept us safe in those hard scrabble years. You a cop. He's one of us. Do our benefactors really know what's best for us? Look at him down there. I told you they'd be coming for us next. Just this once, I hope you're wrong. I can't take it anymore. Something's gonna be okay. What are we going to do? Attention, resident. Miscount detected in your block. Cooperation with your civil hey, you, protection get, team. Here. Permit for ration reward. Head for the roof! There's no time to lose! Please! Please!
Get in here, quick! Keep moving! Head for the- head for the- Dr. Freeman, I presume. Attention. We'd better hurry. The Combine can be slow to wake, but once they're up, you don't want to get in their way. Dr. Kleiner said you'd be coming this way. <laughs> I don't think it occurred to him that you might not have a map. I'm Alex Vance. My father worked with you back in Black Mesa. I'm sure you don't remember me, though. Man, a few words, aren't you? Remember him from Black Mesa? Your old administrator. <laughs> don't get my dad started on Dr. Breen. Through here. Funny, you showing up on this day in particular. We've been helping people escape the city on foot. It's a dangerous route to my father's lab, through the old canals. Today, we're finally on the verge of having a better way. <laughs> Here. Let me buy you a drink. Oh, and by the way, nice to finally meet you. Blast that little... Where did she get to? Lamar! Come out of there! Uh-oh, everything all right, Dr. Kleiner? Oh, hello, Alex. Well, uh, almost all right. Lamar has gotten out of the trade again. If I didn't know better, I'd suspect Barney of trapping and... My goodness. Gordon Freeman. It really is you, isn't it? I found him wandering around outside. Bit of a troublemaker, isn't he? We owe a great deal to Dr. Freeman, even if trouble does tend to follow in his wake. I must say, Gordon, you come at a very opportune time. Alex has just installed the final piece for our resurrected teleport. I can't take any credit for the breakthrough, Doctor. Nonsense. Your talents surpass your loveliness. <laughs> Let's just see if this thing works, okay? Well, is he here? There you are. Man, Gordon, you stirred up the hive. We can't keep him here long, Doc. It'll jeopardize everything we've worked for. Don't worry. He's coming with me. Uh, that's right, Barney. This is a red-letter day. We'll inaugurate the new teleport with a double transmission. You mean it's working? For real this time? Because I still have nightmares about that cat. No, no. There's nothing to be nervous about. What cat? We've made major strides since then. Major strides. What cat? Doc, since he's not taking the streets, you might as well get him out of his civvies. What? Oh dear, you're right. I almost forgot. Barney, I'll give you the honor. <laughs> I've got to get back on my shift. But okay. okay. 
Here we go. Ah! Damn it, get it off me! Lamar! There you are! I thought you got rid of that finest! Certainly not. Never fear, Gordon. She's de-beaked and completely heartless. The worst she might do is attempt to couple with your head fruitlessly. Get that thing away from me! Here, my pet. Hop up. No, not up there! No! No! Careful, Lamar! Those are quite fragile! Oh, fie! It'll be another week before I can coax her out of there. Yeah, longer if we're lucky. <laughs> Barney, you're not an animal person. <laughs> Well, Gordon, go ahead. Get into your suit now. <laughs>